how to view your Twitch chat stats with stream elements. Before I begin, I also stream on Twitch, on twitch.tv slash tree. Link is down below in the description. And make sure to stream smarter, not harder. So let's go to streamelements.com and log in with our Twitch. We're gonna authoritize this if you haven't done that yet. Now here at the left, we go to other and chat stats. Here's a bunch of stats. Sadly, they don't have dark mode, so we have to burn our eyes a little bit. We've got multiple categories. These are the total amount of messages that have been sent in your Twitch chat. Messages per second is zero. I'm not sure if this counts offline as well, but I haven't gotten that many messages that every second I would have gotten a message. Then here we can see from the time I started streaming, which is quite a long while ago, 2017, which people have chatted the most, which seems like that Simulus Crit is our top chatter with 15,176 messages after that my bot and then me which is pretty funny that he actually did more than my bot then here we see our top emotes used a lot of these are my own subscriber emotes so the tree love these tree love this one makes sense because it's set to a follower emote this means that all followers can use this emote where this one is set to be only used for subscribers so people have to pay for it these two are actually the same, but I used to have my prefix tree22 and now it's just tree. So basically this is the same emote, but before and after my prefix change. Same goes for this one and this one. It was called love and now it's called woe because this one is also called love. We can't have two loves. Then we have the tree sip, which is part of my tea dad welcoming ceremony. So people spam this when that happens. And then we have some basic twitch emotes and we can basically see hey which of my emotes are most popular underneath the people that watch me so if you want to replace an emote you can see oh which one is the less, least popular one for example this one doesn't get used as much we can try and chase them out and see if that one gets used more we also can have seven tv emotes this is a plugin and you'll see them in here if you have that and if we scroll down we have better twitch tv that's also a plugin you can upload emotes in there and we can see which better Twitch TV emotes are being used in my chat. I've uploaded some myself, like the Trueji one and the Tree Hype one, which are being used as well. And I selected some, like the, the cow one here, that I really like myself to be like coming up automatically. You can also do that for Franker Face. It's also a plugin like better Twitch TV. You can also set up emotes in there. And then we have another one here. It says top commands. These are the top commands in your chat. So all time, right? all time. This means that the chat command that has been used most is hype, which usually I ask people to type that when somebody subscribes, so that makes sense. Then battle royale. I've got this mini game if I'm going to the toilet, that people can do this battle royale, which with a stream that button, it automatically posts this. This will come up every time I go to the toilet. <laughs> and shout outs I do if there's a friend coming over and they stream as well, or if I get a raid. So these are pretty standard, but the things down here, are gonna make it interesting. Which are the commands that a lot of people use that aren't that logical? For example, they can gamble with my stream elements points and we can see that they use those very often. This is a command I can use and this is the one I use myself. Then we see that sweaters, which is checking your points in my shop. So basically exclamation mark points default is being used after that, which makes sense. People will not know how many points they have. And these blue and red are for changing my lights. So I can see that blue is the most common color for people to change the lights to. This is kind of information that you can use to determine what works well in your stream and what doesn't. This is really personal because it depends on what kind of commands you have in your chat, right? Take this information, which emotes do people like, which commands do people use, try to fill it in with context, like, oh, this one I use myself tons of times, so that means that maybe I have deflated the numbers a little bit, or this one is being used, well, people hype for sub and I ask them to do that, where other commands I don't ask people to do it, so people might use that command a little bit more. Try to think about that, what can you do with that, can you change some things, or is it right the way it is? Do you want to set up more things in the stream elements? I got a playlist right here with more stream elements videos. And if you don't want to miss anything, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you want to help me as well and see some cool gameplay content, I make gameplay content on this YouTube channel. So go follow me there as well. We're almost monetized, so please help me. I'll see you there.